Good morning, YouTube. I figured I would start out early. Actually, it's it's 5.45, so it's not that early for me, typically. I'm already well into my cardio, but I'm letting my body rest if it tells me to, because I don't start work until eight o'clock. So I'm about to go do an hour of fasted cardio. Now, before my cardio, I do take Yohimbine. Now, it's really bright in the kitchen, so I'm moving back. But this is the brand that I take. I literally just bought this off of Amazon because I ran out, but I always get my supplements from Coalition Nutrition. They have some really good Yohimbine from uh, Nutribio too, so you can save money there and get free shipping. Their stuff, hands down, is the best. I was just in a pinch, and so I needed to get this. Um, so I will do my cardio fasted, but I always want to tell people, Cardio should be done when you have the time and can consistently get it done. Research has shown that there's really no benefit from doing fasted cardio versus fed cardio. So for me, it's more of a schedule thing. Right now, most days of the week, I'm doing two hours of cardio. So I just, I don't have time two hours after my day gets going to get it done. So knocking out at least an hour right out of the gate is helpful. Plus, if you do take you him being, um, you need to do it fasted. There's no point of taking this unless you're doing fasted cardio. So um, it's also not a magical supplement like any other supplement. It is there just to be that 1% if that. So I am adding that in at this point of prep to really just kind of get me the, the rest of the way there. Um, I am feeling, let's see if I can pretty tight this morning so this is what we look like before we do anything but we're gonna go do some cardio and I'll check back in after I just figured I would do kind of like a typical day of my life right now I just did a full day of eating now my food has changed a little bit since I uploaded that um, just in terms of amounts of carbs. I have less carbs than I do in that video, so less potatoes mostly. Everything else is pretty much exactly the same. So I'm not gonna necessarily show you every meal, but maybe I can take you to the gym. Um, just wanna kinda give you an inside look at my day. You can meet some of my chickens, um, and just wanted to share my journey through this prep as we get closer to peak week and my first warm-up show of the season. So I'm getting down here. I'm doing my cardio. It's quite, yeah, that's way later than I like to start, but we'll do speed 3.4, incline 10. So here we go for an hour. So just got done cardio. I got Dela, Dana, yikes, Dana Lynn Bailey back there watching me, motivating me. Not the prettiest space, but I get to come down and do my cardio right here, which is just like super duper nice and convenient. But I just got done an hour, so 60 minutes, that's a 67, because I was really close to four miles, so I just wanted to get four miles in, but I'll be back down here for another 40 minutes later, either two sessions of 20 or one of 40 if I have the time. So now it's time for some breakfast. Good morning, chickies. Good morning. Hi, Bruno. Hey, Bruno. Where's everyone else? They love their bread. Here you go, guys. I only have one piece today. How are you doing in there? Okay? I made sure to give her some, too. Alright, let's see if I can talk over these birds. They are very noisy in the morning, especially when I give them bread. They freaking love bread. So, that's what I do first thing in the morning because it gets them excited. It gets them out of the coop. But I want to clean that up a little bit. 
Um, typically they don't egg, lay eggs overnight, but if I do have any in here, I will grab them. Um, but I always do this before I start my day. I usually bring their food out from underneath the roof here. Um, we put it under there in case it rains, but uh, checking in with the chickens before the day starts. So I'm a little sweaty because I just finished 20 minutes of cardio. We got an egg. So I literally have eight minutes until my next call today. It's just been nonstop. Like it's almost one o'clock. I've only had my first meal. I've done 120 minutes. No, I've done 80 minutes of my 100 today for cardio. I just have been ra racing around with my head cut off. I have my fish here because it's going to be going in the broiler. <sighs> I just need to take a breather. Like, I need to sit down, I need to eat this salad in eight minutes. It needs to cook, it needs to be made, it needs to be consumed. I just, I normally set myself more breaks than I did today and didn't do it. That's what I get. But when you have goals and it's a Monday, you don't let it slow you down. <laughs> So we're grinding. I need to put this in the oven and get going because I just don't have time. But I wanted to update you because this is life. This is what happens and this is how you manage. Well, it didn't cook in time. It is now 1.20 and I'm finally eating my second meal. My fish salad, which I showed you in my full day of eating. Um, yeah, I'm hungry, so I'm just going to sit down and eat this. <laughs> but... It is what it is. Not every day is easy. Um, I can get some food in me, and I don't have another call until 2 o'clock. So, a little time to de stress, take a breather, get back to the grind. So, before I head to the gym, I am going to show you a package that I just got. Lucky. Uh, wasn't expecting it to arrive today, but my rider wear came, so I figured I will show you what I got and do a little mini try on haul for their new collection. So I'm bringing you guys up into the office to show you the new Enhance Seamless collection that I just ordered. Um, wanted to show you what pieces I got from the new collection so I can share with you my honest opinions. And so I got a set in the blue. I think I just got the top in the blue but I got the bottoms and the top in the like the chocolate or the brown color. And then this is just some extra black shorts. So can't go wrong with black shorts, they go with everything. So I got some colored, but most of the time I'm wearing black or neutral colors. So I figured this would give me some variety, but let me show you what I got. All right, so here's the collections that I got. Enhance Seamless in the brown and then just the blue top with these they have like the scrunch butt um, on the back can't really see it I'll try it on for you guys but it has a cute little like V so it hits just in a really super cute place um, so let me try them on alrighty so this is the sports bra and these are the black shorts you can see like they it's not quite a V, but it does like taper down a little bit. And then the back, there is the scrunch butt. I don't know if you can really tell in that. But this top, I mean, is super comfortable. Now, I get a small in everything. Now, I don't like things fitting super duper tight, so that is why I go for small, not extra small, but they're super stretchy. I would say these tops aren't the most supportive. I don't really have any chest, so this is plenty of support for me, but it's not overwhelmingly supportive if you do have bigger boobs. The brown set that I got in like the Refined Seamless, super cute. I'm really liking this color. It's just something different. I don't have anything this color, um, but you can see it has the scrunch butt and even like some lines to really kind of make your butt look good, um, the little logo in the back. But let me tell you the one thing about this collection, definitely order a size up um, if you're in between sizes because this is a small and a small and these are quite tight. Not uncomfortably tight, but I don't like anything pushing like this much on my midsection and so I would, would almost go for a medium, which I would never say that I'm a medium, but if you're in between sizes, 
I would say I'm between an extra small and a small size up because I can definitely feel that these have some pretty tight compression. The length of the short is really nice. It's not quite a biker length, but you're definitely not going to have anything riding up your butt, especially because I'm training legs next. So I'm going to go drink some pre-workout, but I wanted to show you these new pieces before I head out to the gym. Super quick before I head to the gym, I figured I'd show you my pre-workout. I'm only taking a half a scoop of Limitless. Let me tell you, this stuff is amazing, but it's high stim and it's like past five o'clock. So I'm not gonna overdo it. I already had plenty of caffeine today, but I do love this stuff. And if you're a caffeine junkie like I am, and you're not training at night, highly, highly encourage it. If not, I typically go for a pump, um, but I'm out of it right now. So usually core pump or um, neuro, pump neuro, I'll tag them below, but great options for non-caffeinated, non-stim pre-workouts if you're wanting something to give yourself like a little pump in the gym. But gonna go take this, drive to the gym, and knock out legs before I pass out because I'm so tired. Pre-workout time.